I'm now going to show you how to calculate the cross product using the determinant method. This is the way that most people who calculate cross products do it, uh, but the method in your book is also fine. It's just a little slower. So I'll do it with an example. Suppose you have two vectors, A and B, written as such, and you want to figure out A cross B, which is equal to C. So what you have to do is first construct a matrix, and the matrix looks like this. So, so you make a, a bar, and you're going to arrange I hat, J hat, and K hat in the top row, and then the components of A in the second row, and the components of B in the third row. And now what you have to do is calculate a determinant. Uh, by the way, it's the method for calculating determinants. This is not actually the real determinant for matrices, but it's, it's, uh, the procedure is exactly the same. So what you have to do is um, take the first row, and you're going to focus on the I hat over here, and write I hat, and then you're going to cross out the column and row containing the I hat, like this. And that leaves you with a two by two matrix, and I'll just draw the matrix like this. After you get good at it, you don't have to write all this stuff out. Okay, then the next thing you have to do is figure out what to do with the J hat. I have to go to another paper here because it's getting crowded. So here you go. So let me rewrite the I hat part of it. Okay, so it's going to equal I hat times, uh, times 2, 3, 0, 1, like this. And then the next thing you have to do is write the J hat part of it. So what you do is you write minus J hat. You have to have that minus there. Uh, just do it. And then you cross out the column and row containing the J hat, and then write the box of numbers that's remaining, which is 1, 3, minus 2, 1. And then you have to do the same thing for k hat. Now you must make that a plus k hat. Cross out the box and row containing the k hat. Oh, sorry, Co cross out the column and row containing the k hat, leaving you a box that is 1, 2, minus 2, 0. To evaluate what you just wrote, let's start with the i hat. You have to multiply the diagonals. 2 times 1, so that'll be this, minus 3 times 0. And altogether, that's going to give you 2. Then you go to the next term. Multiply the 1 times 1, that's like this, minus 3 times negative 2. And that's going to give you uh, 1 plus 6, or 7. And then you go to the third term. And that's going to give you 1 times 0 minus 2 times minus 2. And that will give you um, 4. So your answer is going to be 2i hat minus 7j hat plus 4k hat.